today I'll be making a tater tot casserole, which is one of my family's favorite recipes. Um, so what you'll need for this is some tater tots, hamburger, creamy mushroom soup, and then milk, or if you don't have that, just some water is fine. So let's go ahead and get right to it. Okay, so the first step is to cook your hamburger. So I have already started cooking it, and then once it's completely done, after about like 10-15 minutes, uh, It'll be time to drain the grease out. So, so after you strain your uh, beef and get all the oil out, you can place it into your pan, your casserole dish, and then we will go ahead and put the cream of mushroom soup in there. So this is what it will look like after you take out the cream of mushroom soup. And so you just need to spread it throughout the pan and coat it evenly everywhere. This will help keep it moist as you bake it. So now this is finished and it's in an even sort of flat layer and we'll begin placing our tater tots. So what we're going to do is we're going to place our tots in lines. So just start right here and then work your way up, creating the line. So the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to pour milk throughout to keep it moist while it bakes. If you don't have the milk, it's okay, you can use water, um, but this just kind of helps to keep it better. But um, try, I'm going to add a little bit more, but try to get it up to the lip of the tater tots. I like to use the can that the cream and mushroom soup came in, and then you get all the little tidbits of cream and mushroom in there as well that are left over. Okay, and that's... That's it. Then it'll go in the oven at 375 for about 30 to 45 minutes. If you uh, have a bigger pan, as this one's kind of small, then you can do it for an hour to an hour and a half. And so let's go ahead and do that. Here it is. It's been about 45 minutes for it, so I'm going to go ahead and take it out. It is all golden brown and delicious. So sometimes I like to eat it with sour cream, so that's a good choice, but uh, I hope you have fun making this and see you next time.